Young people are the world's greatest hope in the struggle against HIV. Today's youth have inherited a lethal legacy that is killing them, their friends, their brothers, sisters, parents, teachers, and role models. More than two decades into the epidemic, the vast majority of young people remain uninformed about sex and sexually transmitted infections. Although a majority have heard of AIDS, many do not know how HIV is spread and do not believe that they are at risk. Those young people who do know something about HIV often do not protect themselves because they lack the skills, the support, or the means to adopt safe behaviors. The youths will undergo training to be better informed about HIV and to better inform others about it as well. This will take place in a series of training workshops led by program facilitators. Salvin Lewis, a facilitator coming from Trinidad to help train peer educators, spoke about the ways in which the youths are most receptive to receiving information, going beyond lectures, but creative ways, ways which will excite youths about learning and remembering what they have learned. When you start interacting with individuals your age, you then would have to take on particular strategies and approaches that would interest them as well. And who better would, who, 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 who would be best in terms of the driver's seat to know what other young persons would want, you know? My organization has been coming to the Turks and Caicos Island. This year makes it our sixth year. Um, I think if you're doing any program consistently for more than three or four years, um, it probably would suggest that there are some things that are happening that are probably on target. Youths will be trained for a week and at the end of the training they will be certified as peer educators ready to educate their peers about HIV and the AIDS virus. I want you to take the index finger, that's your finger right after your thumb, and point to you. Point to yourself. Point to yourself and say, I'm it. I'm it. Good. As long as you understand that, you are the secret weapon in the fight against this virus. You are the only means, method, and opportunity to turn the tide of new infections, to change the attitudes against people who have become HIV positive, against the thoughts about sharing knowledge about sex, sexuality, and sexual reproductive health. You are the only hope. 